Good morning and welcome to News and Coffee Time brought to you by Intieste.com. We'll be reading the headlines of Il Piccolo in English daily, so grab yourself a cup of coffee and follow us along. We're skipping over the national news and then only concentrating on the local Tiestas headlines. We're bringing you local news one day at a time. The front page of Il Piccolo this Wednesday, January 12th reads, It is Liliana, but the autopsy still leaves the experts puzzled. Uh, the mystery remains what happened to the poor woman who's been missing since December 14th, whether she was killed, there's a, uh, there's a possibility of suicide. Her husband says, my life has no sense any longer. Mm, Bianchi from Italian Parliament says that uh, there'll be a way to get vaccinated directly in schools so that all the kids taking part in the learning process are vaccinated. Uh, there are thousands of people in Friuli-Venezia Giulia who are in isolation and the tracing is almost impossible, says Ricardo Riccardi. Uh, there are just too many cases to keep track of. Uh, a 17 year old was killed for jealousy, due to jealousy reasons in Trieste uh, exactly a week ago. Uh, the a recent contract had, was signed on, on Tuesday, January 11th, between Friuli Venezia Giulia region and um, Trinitalia. 400 million of investments and 25 new high-tech trains will be in We'll be here in, uh, in Friuli Venezia Giulia come this year. The infamous tram is still not working in Trieste and there seems no end in sight for the works that has been, have been going on for two years now. Uh, the residents of Trieste are indignated uh, indignant, they would like the tram to be back on track. Pun intended. Uh, the famous Carnival of Muja will most likely be moved to June to save the holiday, say the organizers of the famous all over region Carnival of Muja where thousands of people dress up and walk down the streets of the little town in the name of the Grand, Grand Festa. Picture of one of the readers of Mole Audace. In today's culture section, uh, Carmen and Desdemona will be staged on Friuli Venezia Giulia theaters. Uh, Shakespeare continues to take over the uh, theatrical world of a region. Pino Furlan, a local painter, will, ex will exhibit its works. It's, his works will be exhibited at Ronchi dei Legionari. Weather forecast sees uh, blue skies and really windy day out here in Tiesa. Bor is here to stay for this Wednesday as well. This has been News and Coffee Time brought to you by Intrieste.com. We're bringing you local news one day at a time. Thank you for listening.